Good morning and welcome to the Mike Show for, what is it, Wednesday, May 2nd, 2018. 58 degrees, it's about, oh, I think 10, 15 a.m. Oh, and I'm not feeling good, aside from the usual aches and pains. I got a bit of a headache and some intestinal stuff going on. Sitting here with my co-star, Samuel. And Audie, who despite her issues, her major handicap to being blind, she's doing quite well today, and I'm grateful for that. And there's my friend Maxie. Mikey's up in the bed. I was a bit upset with him earlier because I got up and let them all out, and it was raining, and I wanted to go back to bed, and Mikey wouldn't come home. So I don't know where he was, but I'm, he's, I'm glad he's back safe anyway. Oh, boy. I don't remember if I mentioned yesterday about my getting the results of my physical back. The blood work was, uh, as usual, my cholesterol was just a little high, and I'll take care of that, I told him. It wasn't as high as it was last year. I think it was 212, and the LDLs were at 130, so... Ain't nothing I can't take care of with a little change in diet and some exercise. Uh, and they want to give me an MRI. I did confirm that I have some arthritis between a couple of my, my L4 and L5 vertebrae, but higher up, I don't remember which number they called it, but I've got compression cracks, so they want me to schedule an MRI, and I'm waiting for the hospital to call me for that. Oh, it is disconcerting to start getting all these medical issues, you know. You've been hearing me whining on for months about back pain and my knees and my elbow now and my right, my left hand. And I just, you know, what do you do? It's not too bad out today. I'll tell you yesterday, um... It got up to 88 degrees, I couldn't believe it. And when I was out at Larry's um, cleaning off the brake wall on the channel, if I'd have had shorts, I'd have jumped in the lake. And I know it would have been cold, but I would have done it. Because <laughs> you only live once. You only live once. So I was supposed to go out there for a couple hours today, but between not feeling so good um, and we got more rain forecast I didn't think it'd be re really wise to go out there so I just texted him and told him I wouldn't be there and I might get out and tr try to go ride a bike I don't know lift me up spiritually maybe get some fresh air in me that'll help me out did actually sleep with some windows open last night. It was so warm in the house. <laughs> Go from freezing cold to uh, having to sleep with windows on, open. And I just thought of another thing uh, with my uh, physical. I did have a fever when they when I was there for that, a light fever, but a fever nonetheless and that's something else I guess now that I'm aware that it's actually my temperature is actually higher I do have that and maybe that's for some of the chills and stuff that I've been getting have been coming from but I'll tell you what this just sucks you know especially for somebody like me who likes being active and doing things and uh, you know physically and spiritually I've just been taking a beating this last year and I'm doing what I can to pull out of it and keep rolling on. But when your body don't let you do certain things, you can't do them, you know? And like everything else, man, uh, there's one of my touchstones readings touches on the issue. We, I can't remember exactly what it says, but... Our bodies aren't our own either, you know. In our health, we can 
control certain things to some extent, but we don't know what's going to happen to us. We don't know what's going to happen to us. So with that, I am going to pause and sit here with these sweethearts. I think we had a few birds out there. No, nothing now. The neighbor's got some chickens over there. I don't know if you can see them. That's yeah, a pretty poor angle, but I think they got four or five chickens over there now in the backyard. And probably to get some eggs. I'm glad there's not a rooster. So right now that's all I got. I'm going to pause. <laughs>